Hello, animal lovers, and welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to explore a somewhat controversial topic. Why the Chow Chow, such an adorable dog, might not be the best choice for families with children. If you're thinking about adding one of these dogs to your family, this video is for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more informative content like this. Chow Chows are one of the most distinct and recognizable dog breeds, not only because of their unique appearance, but also because of their distinctive personality. Originating from China, these dogs have a rich history and are often associated with symbols of pride and nobility in their homeland. Let's dive deeper into the characteristics that define Chow Chows. The most notable feature of Chow Chows is their dense and fluffy coat, which can be smooth or rough. They are known for their lion-like mane, which gives them an imposing appearance. Additionally, their blue-black tongue is a unique feature among dogs, further adding to their distinctiveness. They have a robust body and dense bone structure, with a facial expression that often appears stern or distant. Chow Chows have a complex personality. They are known for their independent and often reserved temperament. Unlike other breeds that may seek constant attention from their owners, Chow Chows are more self-sufficient. However, their independence can turn into stubbornness, which can pose a challenge during training. They are territorial dogs and can be very protective of their owners and property, making them excellent guard dogs. However, this same trait means they need early and consistent socialization to ensure they are well-adjusted and friendly towards strangers and other animals. Caring for a Chow Chow requires special attention, especially regarding their coat. They need regular brushing to prevent tangles and keep their fur in good condition. Additionally, as they are prone to certain health conditions such as hip dysplasia and eye problems, it's important to ensure they receive regular checkups from a veterinarian. Training a Chow Chow can be a challenge due to their independent and stubborn nature. They respond best to consistent and positive training methods. Early socialization is crucial for developing a well-adjusted Chow Chow, especially to minimize territorial and aggressive tendencies. Unfortunately, there have been several reports of incidents involving Chow Chows. In 2018, California, there was an incident involving a Chow Chow dog. The reported case drew attention to the potentially aggressive behavior of some dogs of this breed and raised questions about the safety and responsible breeding of pets. The incident, which resulted in severe injuries, is not an isolated case, but one among several reported in the media involving Chow Chows. One such incident occurred when a Filipino television and film star was attacked by a Chow Chow, resulting in injuries to the right arm, right leg, and left breast, requiring hospitalization. Another tragic incident occurred in England, where a Chow Chow jumped a low fence and attacked a sleeping newborn, apparently out of jealousy. Furthermore, in Pennsylvania, a three-year-old girl was killed by a Chow Chow attack while her parents slept in another room. Why do these incidents occur? Experts emphasize the need for early and ongoing socialization, positive and consistent training, and the importance of understanding signs of stress and discomfort in dogs to prevent aggressive behavior. The territorial nature of the Chow Chow and their mistrust of strangers can lead to aggressive behavior if not properly managed. Potential Chow Chow owners are advised to thoroughly research the breed and carefully consider whether their lifestyle and environment are suitable for a dog with the unique characteristics of this breed. What is life like with a Chow Chow in a household with children? Let's explore the specific challenges, including the need for constant supervision during interactions with children and the safety measures that families should adopt. Interactions between Chow Chows and children should always be supervised. This is due to the independent and sometimes protective temperament of the Chow Chow, which can lead to unpredictable reactions to abrupt or invasive child behaviors. Providing a safe space where the dog can retreat and relax away from children when needed is important for the well-being of the animal. It is equally important to teach children how to interact safely and respectfully with the dog, including avoiding tight hugs, touching the dog's food or toys without supervision. Learning to identify signs of discomfort or stress in the chow chow can prevent incidents. Signs such as growling, retreating, or a rigid posture indicate that the dog needs space. Preventing accidents outside the home is also crucial. Ensure that the dog cannot escape from the yard or house, and implement safety measures such as securely closed gates. 
This way, you can avoid situations that may pose a risk to neighborhood children. Training and socialization are fundamental. Here are some expert tips on how to train and socialize a chow chow. Socialization should begin between 8 and 16 weeks of age for the puppy. This is a critical period when puppies are more receptive to new experiences, which can shape their adult behavior positively. Introduce your chow chow puppy gradually to a variety of situations, people, and other animals to avoid overwhelming them and potentially causing anxiety or fear. Each new experience should be positive. Use treats, toys, and praise to reward your puppy for calm and acceptable behaviors during new encounters. Obedience training is crucial for managing your chow chow, especially in public settings. Teach basic obedience commands and loose leash walking, rewarding desirable behaviors with high-value treats. Consider enrolling your chow chow puppy in structured socialization classes. These classes provide a controlled environment where your puppy can learn essential social skills. Respect-based training is essential. A dog that respects you will do as you say and interrupt what they are doing when you say no. This involves interacting with your dog in ways that promote respect. Training methods that make the dog feel good are preferable to those based on fear or dominance. It's less about teaching commands and more about how you live with your dog, sending the right messages through your daily interactions. If you encounter resistance or uncooperative behavior during training, don't hesitate to seek professional help from a certified dog trainer. The Chow Chow can become a well-adjusted and beloved member of the family, even in a household with children. It's crucial to remember that the key to a successful relationship between dogs and children involves constant supervision and teaching children how to interact correctly with the dog, promoting a safe and harmonious environment for everyone. In terms of health, Chow Chows can be prone to certain health conditions, such as hip dysplasia, eye problems, and certain skin diseases. Proper nutrition, regular veterinary care, and moderate exercise are essential to maintain their health. Genetics play a role in the temperament and health of any dog breed. Choosing a responsible breeder who selects for positive temperament and health, in addition to physical characteristics, can make a significant difference in the overall behavior and well-being of the dog. This doesn't mean that all chow chows will be aggressive, which is why early socialization and training are essential. Now, we'd love to hear from you. Do you have a chow chow? Or are you thinking of getting one? Share your experiences and questions in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you for watching. Remember, every dog is an individual, and with proper training and care, many of the challenges can be overcome. If you found this information helpful and want to stay updated on all things related to pets and animal care, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Until next time, keep loving these amazing animals.